Music can move a message in this society. The 60s, motivated by lyrics that had language of outrage and change. Where is the music to motivate this moment? Public Enemy says right here. They have a new cut called State of the Union, STFU. Here's a taste. I am law, and you are not. In fact, I'm God. I got a lot, Mr. These United States take over, come over. Orange hair, fear the comb over. Here's another scare, keep them hands in the air. Better not breathe, get there, not there. Public Enemy founder Chuck D is here. Chuck is one of the cleanest uh, artists I've ever heard in the rap yep. genre. Uh, but just in case, just in case you weren't paying attention, Mr. I am the law and you are not. In fact, I'm God. I got a lot. Mr. These United Breaks take over, come over. Orange hair, fear the comb over. Here's another scare. Keep them hands in the air. Better not breathe. You dare not dare. Uh, we talked about this, Chuck, about the need for uh, music to enter this moment. Um, what do you want for this song? Why did you take this on and put yourself in the ring once more? Chris, what, uh, what's up, man? My tech is running right tonight. What did your grandma say? Yay, yay, yay. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, Yo, as a New Yorker, unfortunately, we're New Yorkers with this guy that comes out of New York born in 1948. We've seen it for a long time. Yep. I mean, this this guy's nothing new to us. There's no animosity, and, but you get four more hey, years, there's going to be some real animosity. We see this guy uh, for such a long time pull his, you know, his shark game on people. We're saying go back to your casinos, your buildings, your yep. fake reality shows. Exactly. You know, go back to the USFL. You just don't need to be president. Thank and, you. And forget November. Shark day. Uh, like earlier... Uh, Mr. Axelrod said, man, these are the most unpredictable days ahead. No one knows what's going to happen next week. Yep. And you want to talk about November. So coming after Paul Rykoff, I echo your, your last three guests, you know, highly because you have to be a fool not to see this, this ridiculousness going on right now. And the exactly. song answers to that. And the minute I, I, every time I used to see on social media or, or, or the internet, S O. T.U., State of the Union. It wasn't just talking about Jake Tapper's show. It was talking uh, about the President of the United States is going to make an announcement. Immediately, over the last four years... I love Jake Tapper. STFU popped up in my head, and that's where the lyric came from. Nice. And uh, the, the great DJ Premier helped bring it to fruition. Excellent. Music can speak for the masses yep. and can spark change. It's not Music for the masses. the change. But it can be a reminder to do actual things for real people. We can't look for at regular people and everyday people for being lesser than. Yep. They're greater than. Yep. We can make uh, the change by eliminating all... that fact. Uh, cool. I couldn't agree more God. about the power of music, especially your own. I, I am without qualification when I say I have no objectivity when it comes to Public Enemy or Chuck D. I, I grew up on the music. It helps yeah. my understanding of social discourse Beastie and, and uh, social Dude. unrest. And I've always appreciated you for that. You know that. Why is it uh, still? As powerful as these yeah. lyrics are, you think that there is any chance that the president steps away before November? You got to Nixonize him. I say Nix him now. N I X H I M N O W. I have to be old enough to remember that there was so much Chaos. foolishness done by a president that he had to walk away, and yep. it forced him to walk away. It's like like you created too much havoc Take and BS. Out. Um, this guy's had a, had an effect. We just heard Paul Rykoff talk about internationally and amongst even people that go and work in the world in the U.S. services around the world. And they're on the tenuous, you know, thread right now. Locally, he's echoed harm. Nationally, he's a problem. So do I think he's going to walk away? You have to put, you know, keep your foot it's on the gas and pressure. say, dude, we're asking and telling you that you just got to go. Yep. No animosity, but if you stay in that seat, you, why would the other guy running for president, Joe Biden, says, listen, if he doesn't leave, I might have to get the military to make him leave. This is Crazy. the most ridiculous conversation ever for the for the everyday citizen living here in this country and around the world. Yep. 
that it ever could be that they're talking about like Trump is some cool or something going joke. on. Everybody's unsure about what's going on. I hear you. And you got to be able to, yeah, you got to be able to say, listen, man, guy ain't playing by the rules, man. Yep. He's not playing by the rules, Chris. He never was. I mean, every day, you know, you're looking at something that lines up with the symbolic hatred that we feel every day as a, as a people, as a black person, if a president of the United States says, I'm going to keep the losing side right. on, as a statue Crazy. in the city, and I'm going to arrest you for taking down the losing side, which is the Confederacy, I got a problem with that. For years, we were able to like kind of like ignore the, 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 the overt racism, all the subtle racism and symbols and statues. And this can tell you that symbols are powerful, Chris. Anybody that says they're not powerful, go put a swastika in the middle of your forehead yep. and see the amount of conversations or stares that come back at you. Right. That's something that we see every day. And a statue and a statement or a gesture or in a national conversation that's offensive. I get the, it. The song that I wrote, the, the song that I wrote, Chris, it has in, inappropriate language, but in context, it's appropriate for the dude that's been yep. inappropriate that's pressing. That's right. right. That, and that you music, can make that change. And that's Thank a you, function of music. Uh, people can Not judge the they can, It's out there for criticism. It's out there for social critique. You're the man. You've always done that with your music. Here's your bigger it's problem. All right. It's all right. Here's your bigger problem. Yes. I'm not worried about the vernacular. Um, you have a movement right. in this country, but you've got a lot of young people. First, you know the black vote has to come out in a way it didn't in the last election. But you have a fractured left as well. you got people who are going to say Biden... Biden passed that crime bill. Biden's old school. We need new school. Biden doesn't represent me in my interests. I don't like Trump. I don't like Biden. I'm not going to vote. I feel you. I feel you, Chris. Anybody that's running for president of the United States or any office over 70 years old is, is definitely not talking about any future. I believe a mandatory retirement age for government should be 65 and yep. leadership should be 40 to 65. Now, what do you say to the people who say but, they're going to sit this one out? Oh boy. Dude, I said Biden there to pick a black woman as his vice president. You better not make that position benign. That position cannot be benign anymore. Yep. So, yeah, I'm waving my fist with Stacey Abrams or yep. Kamala Harris or somebody that's going to do yep. the job every yep. day. Yep. And that's what Paul was talking about, man. Time of politicians just yapping, yapping, yapping. The young movement is a leaderless done. movement. You can't point to one person. That's why they're saying enough of that and they're attacking their local OGs like us. To yep. look at this guy and said, I'm joke. mad at this guy who's a president who put out a bounty on the Central Park Five. Yep. But I can make those answers in culture and music. And this is the difference, Chris. If you got the whole world, right? And I travel around the whole world when I get a chance, especially this crazy, not this You've crazy time now. But the whole world's looking at this as a stage clown show. And half the country's looking at this as a stage clown show. What does that tell you? That tells you you should just quietly... GTFOH, bro. Yeah. I can make these statements in music, and music is something that's worldwide. Yep. It goes through the technology. And I tell boundaries. All the time, beware of the old tricks in new ways. I so know. they communicate Evil. through the phones, but what if the grid goes down I all of a sudden cool. before election day? Yep. Then you got young people who see through this. They yep. see through this. And younger mm -hmm. adults is where we got to instill confidence that Precisely. they are leaders and the leadership is there. Not in a bunch be the of change you want to see in society. To be octogenarians, man. I got that you. This doesn't work. Well, bro. we'll yep. see, we'll see what work. they'll do. You're resonating the message as only you can. Um, S O T U, State of the Union, S T F U is the cut. Uh, one more line from it. Better rock that vote or ro vote for hell. Real generals now, not some USFL. Not an effing game. I dare not mention his name. Operation 45. Yeah, it's the same thing. Sounds like Berlin burning. Same thing. Uh, history's a mystery if you all ain't learning. End this clown show for a real estate bozo. <laughs> Only you, Chuck D. I'm, Only I'm, you. I'm, I'm, economic, I'm economical with the words, man. I learned from all the best, man. Thank you. You're the man. On, on, uh, Mr. CC and then. Listen. Thank you, Chris. Listen. You're always welcome. Namaste to both. From the best. Uh, and not be one of the best, and you are that. And from the underground, Chuck D. And it's far from over for you. Thank you for making music that matters. Chuck yep. D. Well, and move the world. What, what did your grandma say? Aye, aye, aye. That's right, And right, she'd say, right. be more like your brother. Hmm. I'll talk to you later. Well, we'll be right back. All right. All right.